Assalamu alaikum students I hope you all are fine students we are in unit 3 that is spreadsheets in excel okay today we will see that how we can save a spreadsheet file in our computer every spreadsheet must be saved and assigned a name to distinguish it from other spreadsheets the first time you save a workbook excel will prompt you to assign a name through the save as operation we can see uh, in this image that uh, the save as dialog box is appear so this is the dialog box which will appear whenever we save our spreadsheet the method to save your spreadsheet is given below first we have to click file then select save from the menu bar or we can just press the control plus s shortcut key or click on the save button these are the three ways to uh, select the save option the save as dialog box will appear as we can see here in this image this is the save as dialog box third we have to type file name in the file name box currently the file name which is entered here by default that is book 1 so we can change that name according to our requirement and then finally click save button to save the spreadsheet okay in the next slide i'll be demonstrating practically that how we can save a spreadsheet file in our computer so don't forget to watch that video So now we will see that how we can save a spreadsheet file. Let's say I am opening a new Excel file. Okay, This is the file and something that I have already copied from another Excel file. I will paste it over here. Okay, So this is the data. Let me apply some formatting. size make it bold okay one second row make it bold you can change the color also and increase the font size and uh, okay so adjust the width of you can also make it the center and the other data elements are also supposed to be at the center okay so we have applied some of uh, the formatting we have made some changes in this uh, uh, excel file all borders now now if I want to save this uh, file in, our, in my computer permanently for this purpose I can uh, just click on the file menu and here we can see the, the save button when I click on it the same save as dialog box will appear here first it will ask me that where I want to save this uh, file let's say if I select the desktop so the same the same save as window appears so this is one way of uh, selecting the save option let me cancel it and another way of doing the same thing is you can just click on this save button when i click on it the same uh, window appears and then i select desktop the save as window will appear and another way of doing this by using the keyboard shortcut key so i will just uh, press the control plus s shortcut key and the same window will appear control plus s here i will select the folder where i want to save and the same save as dialog box appears so here i will just uh, enter the name of this file like for example this is the name that i have assigned to that file and then I will click on the save button 
now this file is saved in my computer with the name salary report when i close this file here i can see on the desktop this file is saved salary report when i double click this file the same file is going to be open and another option which is uh, not discussed in your book but it is uh, important to know that why that option is used that is save as option save and save as what is the difference between save and save as save option is used whenever you save a file for the first time and later on if you want to save the same file with a different name so for that purpose the save as option is used let's say if i want to save the same file with a different name so i will click on the save as option then it asks me for the folder where i where i want to save let's say i will select the desktop here the old name is salary report let's say if i edit this name salary report final or i can make it final salary report so i have changed the name i am uh, saving this file with an another name so when i click the save button that file is saved final salary report so now i'm closing this file i have closed it the old file is also there which was named as salary report and the same file which was saved by an another name that is final salary report is also saved as a different file so these are two separate files which are saved with uh two uh, different names so th this is how the save and uh, save uh, save is commands are different from each other so i hope you have got uh, this thing clearly if you have any question you can ask me in the comments thanks okay students that's it for today if you have any question you can ask me in the comments and don't forget to subscribe my channel computer tuition academy Thanks a lot take care Allah Hafiz